We are now welcoming you as the fourth and fifth classes at Amani Institute. You will join 53 people who have gone before you from over 20 countries that have taken the program and are now all over the world being active change makers in companies, in, as social entrepreneurs starting their own ventures, and in nonprofit organizations everywhere from Argentina to China. You will take 10 courses in, all of your, in your time at Amani Institute. Most of those will be short, intensive, three or four day courses. But there are two courses in particular that are going to span the entire five months, starting from now through the immersion phase. These two courses are our umbrella or capstone courses uh, across the whole program. They are the inner journey of the change maker and the process of social innovation. The reason we have this course is because when we were starting a money institute and talking to people at the very top of the social change sector, these are people who've changed the world, literally. I'm talking about Nobel laureates, about UN leaders, leaders of UN departments, um, about people who've been working in the same tribal community for three or four decades. We found something almost startlingly consistent in what they were saying. All these people who've been working for three decades emphasize the importance of the personal side of change-making work. That you will not succeed as a change-maker if you haven't understood who you are more deeply, why you want to do what you do, how do you stay resilient or sustainable on a personal level in the process. The core structure of the Inner Journey program consists of five steps that are cyclical and all change-makers go through in their career. You will not just do these steps once, you will do them multiple times. The five steps of the inner journey draws on a range of academic disciplines, from mythology, things like the hero's journey, to more modern understandings from psychology about what it takes to build a life of purpose. I'd now like to introduce you to one of my colleagues, Geraldine, who has been key in, de in developing the inner journey of the change. Hello everyone, I'm so excited to meet you virtually and hopefully soon also in person. My name is Geraldine, as Roshan was already saying. I'm from Germany and I've joined Amani Institute three years ago and it was a really exciting process to help develop the curriculum. My background is in adult education in the creative sector but also in mediation and body work. So I'm personally very passionate about the inner journey of the change maker because I'm very interested in how personal and social change interlock and um, support each other. For me, it's not just important that you understand who you are and what are your strengths and weaknesses and how do, how, what are your patterns, uh, your mental models and how can you work with them um, in, to, to be more effective in creating change and also more resilient in the long run. But it's also that you will always be working with people, be it as a team member or leading a team um, and people all go through an inner journey no matter whether they are conscious of it or not. And for you to consciously go through a structured process where you can look at what tools and what approaches and what perspectives help you personally in forging this way um, will also help you support other people in their journey more. And that is important both for working in teams but also in terms of understanding better what it actually really takes to create change. So when you develop a strategy how to you know, create change in a community or work with the government or protest against the government or work with private corporations or other social change organizations. Um, the hardest part is always the implementation and the implementation hinges on people's ability to create change and how slow that is but also how possible it is you will find out in the end.